Hey guys, this is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fail on the one end. Uh, yeah, I'm here at my basement right now. Here to make a video on a very awesome computer that I had in my childhood. This is... Uh, oh, sorry about that. Okay, this is, uh, De uh, this is the Dell Dimension 4600. Um, this computer runs Windows XP on it. And then <clears throat> this, is, this computer's from 2004. So, yeah, I, I, think I, I think we had this computer for like 14 years. Probably, it's like pretty old now. So yeah, this computer runs Windows XP. So yeah, um, before we turn it on, so there are speakers, I turned the speaker on, so this this speaker, this one, it has a power switch, that way you can turn it on so you can hear the speakers. And it also has a volume control too. Also a headphone jack. Same thing goes for the computer right here, although you can't see it. And there's this, oh, yeah, okay. There's this Intel logo right here. And the monitor I'm using, this is a ViewSonic monitor. I used to use this in the family room for that computer that runs Windows 7. Even though this is usually the computer that runs this computer right here in the basement. So, yeah, um, look at the label here that says Windows XP Home Edition. This is what it runs in, so, yeah. This is the type of Windows XP operating system it runs. So, uh, mostly I use Windows XP Professional for virtual PC and VMware. But this is Windows XP Home Edition. So, we're going to turn the computer on. Here we go. Alright, there it is right here. I haven't used this computer in a while, so I'm very happy to use it again. Seems like a, the computer might not do good, so. Uh. It's gonna take time, viewers. You know what? Give it a second. Okay. I think it took time. I do not know what noise I just heard, but yeah. Alright, here it is. So, yeah. Windows XP is running. But yeah, sorry if I heard a beep. This green light right here. This, it powers on. And this one, the, the, I think this is where the disk drive works. I don't know. And right, here's the... <clears throat> this, this must be the Windows XP... Uh, Windows XP welcome screen. It shows you all the accounts. Uh, this is my account. This is my dad's account. I don't think my mouse might be working good. Uh, this is my mom's account, and this is the guest account. I'm going to log into mine. I mean, I know that Windows XP is, like, out of support, but I'm going to type in my password to see if it works. Okay. I'm going to cover this, like always. Okay. It's going to take time, so... Give it some time, viewers. Loading your personal settings. This is what it says right here. Every time you start Windows. So, yeah. I think the, this green light right here, this this is where the... I think this is where the DVD-ROM drive works, probably. I don't know. But, yeah, this is a good computer, like always, and it's it's a good one. But um, I don't know if I'll use my account anymore because Windows XP is out of support. Um, I wonder when the Windows XP startup sound's going to play. So, yeah. I know that you viewers may know. I haven't used this in a while. Yet, you know, this is getting really boring. It's going to take time. Give it some time, viewers. Okay, I think I may have waited a few seconds. But I still don't even hear the startup sound. Like, just look at this. It still says, welcome. I don't even know why, but yeah. I haven't used this computer in a while. It is pretty old, however, I mean, it's like 14 years old. But it's a still good working computer whatsoever. However, there might be a disk failure, but the computer still works. Uh, are you gonna play the startup sound? Seriously, dude? Come on, dude. Just do it. Make your dreams come true. Seriously. Do it. Just do it. Seriously. 
yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it. Let your dreams come true. Oh. Oh, I think it might be loading. Oh. It's finally loading. Look at that. So yeah, it's finally logging me on. But it's going to be bad because there's going to be an error. Oh, and this must be my desktop background. This is Carnival Games Mini Golf. I took a picture of this with my old camera. Well, I I don't know if that one camera, yeah, that camera, that, the Fisher Price camera I used to take a picture of this right here. I don't know if I used my, uh, I think I did use my old Fisher Price camera to take a picture of this. And it seems that I don't think I hear anything from the speakers. Oh, crap. <laughs> you know what? This takes a long time, viewers. Give it some time. All right, so as you can see, it's doing pretty fine now. Look at that. You see that? <coughs> see all these icons here? So yeah, there, there's a, there has uh, Outlook Express, Internet Explorer, and there's a recycle bin at the bottom right, and there, there's Pencil Pal Phonics that was installed on the computer. But, uh, unfortunately, I don't know where my copy of Pencil Pal Phonics is. I don't really know. And yet, uh, uh, anyway, also there's a Caillou Magic Playhouse game. There's a Spider Solitaire game. And there's Pinball. I don't know where the other icons are, but yeah. There's also fo folders that I keep things in. Uh, my music and my pictures. Alright, this, this takes freaking time. I, oh, and I see, I see two icons at the bottom right, too. There's a sound thing, and not to mention the internet connection thing, I believe that's what it's called. But, yeah. I believe that the disk drive might work. Hopefully it does. But, anyway. It just takes time. I don't know how long it's been. But give it some time, viewers. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back, and um, let's see. Uh, okay, I had to double click on the recycle bin. I, all right, I think this is probably where all this is. Oh, excuse me. Do I have to restore all this? I mean, I don't know what to do. Maybe I should just click restore anyway. I don't know if this is a good idea. I'll just click no. Yeah, and there are some icons that came back to the desktop right here because they, they were eventually in the recycle bin. I'll just leave it the way it is. Okay, and yeah, here's the start menu. It says some items cannot be shown. There is not enough room to show all the items you have added to the start menu. To display them, please choose smaller icon, smaller menu. I, I couldn't read it all. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, let me just go click on my computer and see if, if the disk drive might be up. I could be wrong, but let's see. I don't think I see it. I think it must be broken. You see, that, that that's the disk drive right here. But unfortunately, I don't think that the disk was there. So you see that right here. Anyway, uh, I'm going to do something else. I, this computer doesn't have good internet anymore. I'm going to pause this for a minute. And after waiting like this, I'll show you what happened when I click on Internet Explorer. So here we go. Oh, and by the way, uh, I haven't used this computer in a while, and it turns out that this is part one of my Dell Dimension 4600 walkthrough. So yeah, that's that. This walkthrough will be split into some parts. Okay, okay it seems that so far it might be working, but I mean, there's no, there's no internet, unfortunately. You see that, um... So I'm on the Google website. This is probably from 2008, unfortunately. So this is outdated. Um, 
Let me see if I can go to something. Let me click on this. Let's, let's click this. There we go. The web page you requested is not available offline. To view this page, click connect. I'll click connect, so. Uh, give, give me a second. Well, crap, I couldn't even do it, so I'm not going to do it. I don't think we have good internet here, but at least I still have a good thing to have. We're not going to reinstall this on this computer because if I ended up doing that, I would lose all my data. But um, let me just eventually, like, you know what? Give me a second. I think the door might be open in the basement, so I'll probably have to close that for a minute. I'll be right back. Okay, I had to close the door because I felt like doing it. Anyway, uh, to start our walkthrough, we're going to go find a tour. All programs, like, look at that. I see that. Oh, my gosh. As you see, there's, like, Hasbro Interactive and LeapFrog Connect. Okay, so we're going to go to accessories. Come on. Come on, go. My, my, my mouse is not going good today. I, I don't think it's good. Oh, crap. Uh... Try to do this. You know what? Give me a second. Something's wrong with the mouse. Okay, I did it. I had to like jump the mouse so that way it's easier. So let's click on tour Windows XP. Alright, so yeah, this says welcome to the Windows XP tour. The tour is available in two formats. Which format do you prefer? Play the animated tour that features text, animation, music, and narr voice narration. Or play the non-animated tour that features text and images only. Um, you know, like always, I'm gonna I'm gonna play the animated tour that features text, animation, voice, and yeah, and voice and narration and music. So anyway, this is, um, I'm gonna check on the sound and see if it's working. Uh, I don't think I hear anything. Let me turn it up. Uh, I think it's broken. Yeah, I, I think the okay, something's wrong. Give me that. Sorry about that. Um, I couldn't hear anything on the computer. I think the speakers might be broken or something. Oh, maybe that's the problem. But anyway, um, I don't know what happened. Probably maybe because the sound's broken. Maybe I should, like, test the sound for a minute. I'll just adjust audio properties. Wait, what about... Okay, Okay, something's wrong. Give me a minute. My, my mouse isn't doing good. Okay, I decided to go into the sounds thing. So, uh, let me just try to test one of the sounds. I don't think I hear anything. Okay, I don't think I hear anything. But anyway, uh... We're going to have to try shutting down this now. Maybe we could have to restart it. So we're going to... Right, we're going to restart this because something may be wrong with it or something. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, I'll be restarting this. Anyway, um, that'll, be, that'll be it for part one of my walkthrough for this Dell Dimension 4600 that runs Windows XP Home Edition on this computer. And, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. So, yeah, I'm restarting the computer right now. Um, but, yeah, part two will be coming soon. And uh, I will see you next time. This is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fan 101 signing off. Thanks for watching.